What's up YouTube, David Gamer here and welcome back to another video and in today's video we're going to be looking at some images of things that need to be invented. So yeah, before we start this video completely, I just want to go over something. So basically, I always have a background in the back of my videos as you can see right now, it's on this video. And say when I'm going to edit and I put this clip in, if I delete the image that's in the background of the video, then it doesn't show up on the actual video itself. And then me thinking that I, that I clicked the right setting, I didn't. I accidentally deleted the clip and all the, edit, all the editing along with it because when you delete the clip, everything goes, the editing, everything. So yeah, I'm having to re-record this. And yeah, I'm just going to say my YouTube schedule now is going to be Wednesday, Friday and Sunday. So I'm going to upload three times a week. And if I can't keep on that schedule, there will defi definitely be at least one video every week. But yeah, let's get started. So this image shows a transparent stapler so that you can see where the hole is. Now that would be very, very handy because a lot of people actually don't really know exactly where the hole is going to be. So just to get it exact on the paper, it would help out a lot because then you can get it exactly where you want it to be instead of it being off place. Because sometimes when you're using the stapler, it's okay, but you need it to be in the exact place that you need it to be so it works a bit better. So yeah, that would be really, really helpful. And then this image shows a reverse microwave that makes things cold fast. Now that would help out a lot, because say if you've got a glass of water and you're going to put it in the fridge, the fridge would at least take at least an hour just to get it up to the temperature you want it to be. Because say if it's like a dead sunny day and you want your drink to get cold fast because like it's boiling and everything, you could just put it in the reverse microwave and then that's just going to do the job for you like a lot faster than what a fridge would do. And this image says, why doesn't someone invent a clear toaster? So you can see how toasted your toast is while it's toasting. Now that would be even more helpful because there's a lot of people in the world that burn the toast without fail pretty much every time they even lay their hands on a toaster. Literally, they burn the toast and I don't understand how people can actually manage to do it all the time. Because usually when it's made, it's like a cancel button on a toaster. But every 20 seconds or so, I just keep on clicking on the cancel button just so I can see how fast the toast is actually toasting because I never like my toast burnt because it tastes awful. And then this image is saying a solar panelled AC that will cool your car while it's parked in the sun. And that would help out a lot because the vast majority of times, and when I'm saying the vast majority, vast majority, I mean every single time when it's boiling and your car is parked outside it when you get inside it is like you've just came out of a sauna literally the seat belts are warm the metal literally burns your skin and it is absolutely awful then you gotta get the windows open and the ac on and it's just awful so having a solar panelled ac i don't know while you're shopping for your car to stay cool inside that would be really really good and then there's a can of Mountain Dew. You know like on cups when you have the handles, that, that green plastic thing is basically like a handle. So I guess that would help you get a better grip of holding the can. You know like say if you might drop it or something, it might reduce the chances of dropping it. I don't know, but it might just make it easier to hold it. So yeah, that would be a pretty good invention. And this image looks to be a shield. So say if you're chopping a vegetable and you got that thing in front of your fingers, if you misplace the chop, it is going to hit the shield and not your hands. So that would save a lot of cuts and it would do a really, really good job. And then this one is a Shazam for a car engine sound for car engine sounds to diagnose problems. That would be really, really good because then you could just detect the problem straight away. Without any messing about, you could quickly figure out what the problem is with your car and possibly get it sorted just straight away you know without having to mess about with anything and then this image is showing it toast bread while you're slicing it now this reminds me of a trend that was happening on youtube you know when you had the um glowing knife degrees challenge or making a knife a thousand degrees you know like just by using like, a gas cooker or something like letting the flames go on the knife and literally it gets so warm and it turns red and that is exactly what this image is doing here the only problem is like, with this image it 
it'll either make the bread freaking set on fire or it will just burn the toast because if you think about how powerful that is one toast has already been cut and look how badly toasted it is like it's over toasted and then this is a waterproof touchscreen keyboard now that would be good because say if you have a drink that's right next to the keyboard and it spills over then basically it's not going to get damaged because it's waterproof now when you have like waterproof stuff i'm pretty sure if you drop it in anything else i'm pretty sure it'd be fine because that counts as a liquid so yeah and then there is this little button on the keyboard and it has a lock and a password written underneath it so i'm guessing if you click this it will lock you out from actually being able to type in your password the only downside of this is if it works as the second you click it you can't type in a password and then that would like lock it out a bit but say someone just click the button again it just let you type in the password now it you wouldn't be able to get in unless you knew the password so i'd think of it like that but it might work a little bit more technical than what i'm saying but anyway thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye guys